So I have a reinterpretation of the uh, Tom Holland movie where he's uh, Nathan Drake. Because uh, he inserted himself all over in the movie. Um, Mark Wahlberg. Yeah, the Wally Berg. So I came up with this concept that uh, you can have this, like, I don't know. It's sort of like a Saturday Night Live skit making fun of New York plays and how terrible they are. Where it's like, he's, you take the scene where he's the bartender, but he's the bartender on the Titanic in the fancy ballroom there behind the bar. And Mark Wahlberg swaggers up as the iceberg that's going to take down the Titanic. And for some reason, Tom Holland's dressed as the Titanic, serving people in the Titanic. Like, he's the heart and soul of the Titanic because he's a 1920s type mechanic. mechanic, you know. Like, he's forward thinking, you know. He's coming across to, you know, discover new uh, delights of America. But he's working his way through as, you know, a poor Irish gay man. And then you got this Mark Wahlberg stepping up into his territory, you know, trying to take him back down. See, what, what the point is how this, this makes sense is they square off and they're all like, he's all like, you think you can stop me in my destiny, huh? As like a lispy gay man. And then like this horrible music starts up from the band where it's all like, just like the worst gay music ever and then they're all like snapping their fingers and circling each other as like it shows outside like the uh iceberg you know on the titanic ship about to hit it as it's reenacted on the dance floor within in gay style as they start circling each other with you know fake plastic knives they pick up, you know? I think this is pretty good. And then finally, um, they epically dash themselves together, wounding each other and falling back as the lights all, you know, flash in all directions out from them and the music crescendos with a terrible, you know, shrieking wail and the drums smash to silence as the ship crashes into the Wahlberg. And they are defeated together in gay glory. That's what I think about the whole scenario. Make you a bunch of faggots. The only reason that that skit about the iceberg is funny with Mark Wahlberg and Tom Holland is because he's supposed to be dressed up like an iceberg, which is what I originally said is that they would be in a roller derby instead. And then he retooled it for this because it was funnier. And that they would be, he'd be an iceberg with his arms sticking out and they'd have a knife so it's comedic on roller skates. And then Tom Holland would be the Titanic, and they'd be circling each other on roller skates with knives. That, that was the joke. Or else it's not as funny. It's, it's too gay and dramatic.